The idea for this video came actually from a phone call yesterday and we had a prospective client call in asking, are you guys real? I looked online, I see 80 plus five star reviews on Google, nothing below five. And I wanna make sure it's real. It's not your cousin, it's not your neighbor, it's not you know, all, all your friends and family just making five star posts so you can look good online. I wanna address those questions. I wanna address those issues and kind of bring to light some of the things you can do to help yourself as you're looking for a contractor and make sure that you're not falling for somebody's fake reviews, stuffing, artificial, inflated rankings. So a few of the things you can do to look at uh, a company being legitimate and having real reviews is when you look at the reviews, is there somebody's name included? Oftentimes, if you read through a company's reviews, you're gonna see salesperson Ryan or repair technician Bill or Kim in the office was extremely helpful. And that means they've probably made that real personal connection to real people on the team. Check out the website. Are those people that actually work there? If it's artificial reviews, a lot of times you're gonna see things like, the gutter replacement was very good. My roof was leaky and now it is fixed. They were very nicely priced. I would hire them again. And they're really just trying to stuff some of those key search term words in there so that we can now rank on Google and kind of artificially cheat the system and very deliberately cheat you. Another great way to, to see if reviews are authentic or if they've been fabricated either by the company or maybe by an outside marketing company would be frequency. So we've had reviews for the last couple of years, a good month you might see 10, some months you might see just a couple, um, some days you'll see a couple come through and you might have none the next week. That's the reality of doing roof replacements that take a day or two and doing roof repairs that sometimes you can see a few clients in a day, but it's definitely not something you're gonna have 15, 20, 50 reviews in a day. When you do see a company getting 100 reviews in a month, unless they're a major national player, I would definitely be very, very skeptical of that. Now, keep in mind, the reason you're checking these reviews is so that you can have a little bit of a screening tool to know the contractor you're gonna hire is a five-star service contractor or a 4.9 service contractor. So the last point that was brought up by our caller was seeing nothing below a five-star review. And I will say we are very, very fortunate right now. We are extremely blessed, we're extremely honored we have only five-star reviews on Google and Facebook as well. Uh, that does not mean we are a five-star contractor. I think it's really, really important when you see five-star not to assume that contractor is perfect, but to assume that they are willing to make it perfect regardless of how the initial experience may have gone. That's important. Reality is using reviews at this point is the modern day word of mouth. That is where folks look to see, can I trust this person? What is their background? What is their story? And it is important that you do a little more digging rather than just looking at a star rating. Read the reviews. Are they real people? Is it a real company? Are they authentic? And do I wanna invite this prospective contractor into my home? So I hope that was helpful. I hope that's some good information as you're reading through reviews and deciding who you're gonna call and contact for the next step. See you on the next video.